I'm going to play a game of solitaire for Hong Kong Mahjong. I do this exercise because it helps me to practice decision making when I play with other people. If you have a Mahjong set at home, give it a try yourself and let me know if it helps your confidence. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. I have all my tiles out and they've been mixed and built into walls next to these risers. This way we can keep track of the progress of the game based on how many tiles are left in the wall. I'm going to deal the tiles. I'll deal 14 to east and then 13 to southwest and north. Everybody has their tiles. We're going to say that it's east round and that there is a three fawn minimum. So everybody has to pick a scoring pattern to qualify. That just keeps people from playing chicken hands, which is a zero point hand. So let's see what we can do for the dealer, which is East, player one. One flower, this is a four flower. That's not for them, that's not their seat. So they won't get score for that, but they will get a replacement. So here, I think they have two pair, right here and right here. I think what I would do is try to get them to a half flush, but if we pair up, do all pung. Right now, all pung is a long shot because there's only two pair. I think I would start by discarding probably the four dot. Let's see what we can do for south. They have a one flower. Okay, this is a nice start to a half flush. They even have Pung and Chow potential here. A pair of green dragons, Pung, Pung, lots of Chow potential, three discards. So I would discard these and go for a half flush. Let's see what we can do for West. They have a one flower. Okay, we've got to get them to three fawn. Right now they have zero fawn. And they have mixed suits, two pair, and just two single honors. I'm thinking a half flush or all pung. Long road to haul, kind of like east. Okay, let's see what we can do for north. Okay, for north, three dots, three bams, four cracks, three honors. That's a pretty big spread. But look at how many honors and terminals they have. I think I would try that. There's a hand called 13 orphans. One and nine of each suit, one of each of the winds and dragons, and then any tile paired. They have a pair right there. So let's see what happens. Okay, we're gonna draw our discard a four dot for east. And we can draw four south. Red dragon, that's nice. They have a pair, two pairs of dragons. We could maybe pung those. That would be three of a kind. Let's get rid of the four dot and draw four west, east. Let's discard let's see we're gonna say it's the east round so that may help them get a fawn right now they have zero fawn if we get a pung at east that's one and then maybe all pung would be three four let's try to get them to all pung so let's go ahead and get rid of the four bam 
and we can draw for north. Five crack. Let's discard the three dot. And draw for east. Four dot, discard. Let's draw for south. Green dragon, pung, but that's concealed. We can keep it a secret. One dot and draw for west. Eight dot. Okay, well that's looking better for half flush. Let's get rid of this five bam. And now we can draw for north. Oh wait, let's pung it. South is gonna pung. And we'll discard seven crack. So they have two potential chows. Here's a pung and a pear. They're really close actually. Let's draw for west. Three flower, they just got their own flower. Player three got a three flower. Okay, south. That could help them get to a half flush. So let's discard this three crack. And we can draw up here for north. Two bam, okay. So we don't have to decide yet. Let's discard a five dot. And we can draw for east, north. Oh, nice, they got a pair right there. We can maybe pung that, pung that, pung that. One, two, three pungs. Let's get rid of this eight dot. And we can draw for south. Seven dot, we'll discard that. And draw for this player. Now, we could maybe have them play half flush if we chow. That would leave an isolated tile there. I think I'd rather pung. Let's draw. Eight crack. Mm. Okay, let's discard the five crack. And we can draw up here. Nine crack. Oh, nice. Okay. I think let's get rid of the two bam. I would love to play a big hand here. All honors and terminals, maybe, or cracks and honors. So we threw a two bam. Let's draw for east. Three crack, we'll discard that. And draw for south. Nine crack, let's discard nine crack. Let's pung it up here. Pung for north. So let's get rid of the two bam. Maybe we could do either cracks and honors or all terminals and honors if we can pair up. Okay, so we do we threw a two bam, let's draw for east. Six crack discard. Nobody can take it, so we'll draw four south. Five crack. Drawing for west. They drew a west. That's their seat. Let's keep it. Since a nine crack was discarded, let's go ahead and throw that. And we can draw four north. Four crack. Okay, there's a chow. So let's go ahead and focus on cracks and honors. Nine dot. And we can draw four east. One crack, discard. We're going to pung it. Pung. And we'll discard the one bam. One bam was discarded, so we'll draw four east. Nine bam. Oh, nice. That's a keeper. We can get them maybe, oh yeah, pungs. We want to do one, two, three, four pair. Okay, let's go ahead and get rid of some of these honors before 
we're stuck with valuable tiles. White dragon. And nobody can take it, so let's draw four south. Two flower, they just got another flower of their own this time. We'll take a replacement. One crack, that's a discard. And we can draw four west. Six crack, we need to get them to dots and honors. Six crack. Half flesh is three fawn, and that will meet the minimum. So we just threw a six crack. We already have a four, five, six. Let's draw. Five crack. Let's discard the nine, bam. And that would be Pung for East. So we have Pungs. Let's go ahead and discard the East. And we're gonna Pung it for West. Let's get rid of the white dragon. Okay, now up here, drawing nine dot, discard. Oh, we're into the third wall now. So this is the middle game. Everybody should have a direction, and I think they do. All Pung, half flesh, half flesh, half flesh. Let's draw for East. Eight dot, discard. Drawing for South, six crack. We're gonna draw for West, nine dot. Okay, that'll help them get to a half flesh. Potential chow, potential pung, potential pung. They need to pair up an honor or draw more dots. Let's discard the seven crack. And we can chow, five, six, seven. And now we can discard, let's see here. There's a Pung of East out. There are no other winds out. Let's keep the North because that's their seat uh, wind. Let's discard a South for them. And nobody can take a South. They're all singles. So we're going to draw for East. Two crack. They just got a Pung right there. Pung. Okay. We need to Pung that North. South was discarded. Let's throw that. And we can draw for South. White dragon, that's been thrown. And this will be a good safe tile. Let's draw four west. Three bam, discard. Drawing four north, one dot, that's a discard. We can draw four east, five dot. We need to pair up. Let's see, five bam, two bam. Let's, there's two two bams out, so let's throw that. And now we can draw four south. Seven bam, okay. So we have a chow and a pear. Chow, pear, pung, pear. Let's discard the south. And they're ready to win on a seven bam or a red dragon. Seven bam or red dragon. Okay, we can put that in order, it won't matter. Okay, here we go, drawing for west. Eight dot, oh nice, that's a good tile. Let's get rid of this eight crack. And now they're cleared to a half flesh. Eight crack, we're gonna draw four north. Six dot, that's a discard. We're gonna pung it, pung for west. Okay, now south I think was thrown a few times, so twice anyway, let's throw this. Oh, three times, that's the last one. Okay, now we're gonna draw four north. Red dragon, okay, we're gonna discard a north. 
and they're ready to win on either a three crack or a five crack. We threw a north, we can pung it for east. And we've got a pung, a pair. We need another pair in here. Six bam, eight bam, none are out, five dot, none. Oh, there's a five dot out. Let's throw that. They need one more pair in here or pung the seven and then wait on one of those. So five dot was thrown. Nobody can take it. Let's draw for south. Four bam. There's a potential. Oh, wait, they're already ready. They're ready on a seven bam and it's not out. There's lots of threes and fours, twos, threes, fours. There's a pung of fives. So let's get rid of the four bam. And we can draw four west, eight crack. We'll discard that. Draw four north, three flower. They just lost a no flower fawn. That's too bad. Four crack. So <clears throat> we could throw the five and they'd be ready on a four crack or a red, but this way they're ready on a three, six, or no, 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 a three or a six. Let's see how many are out, three crack. There's one, two out, five or six crack. There's one, two out. If we did four crack and red, at this stage, somebody might throw a red, but it's, I, I like not to be waiting on it honor, in which case I would plan it to be ready on one tile of four crack. So I think I would stay put. Let's discard the four crack. And we'll draw four east, west. That's been thrown, I believe. No, it has not. Okay, we're gonna draw four south, three bam, discard. We're gonna draw four west, six dot. They have a pung. We're gonna convert that to a kong, which is a four of a kind, and get a replacement. And they have a seven dot. Let's get rid of the west. So they have now seven, eight, nine isolated tiles, a pair. They could maybe pung, pung, we'll see. Let's draw four north. One dot, that's a discard. Let me just show you that Kong. You just stack it like a pyramid. We're gonna draw four east. Green dragon. I'm gonna discard that, a little risky. We have a Kong, either a Kong, well, we could win on a supplement tile, let's Kong it. So we put out our three of a kind, add the Kong tile, and get a replacement tile. Oh, it's a white dragon. Okay, so we'll discard the white dragon. It's an extra point if you can win on a replacement tile. Okay, we're gonna draw four west, four flower, west, discard. That's too bad. We're gonna draw for north, four crack. Oh, they would have won on that. They would have won on that. Oh, that's too bad. Let's discard. Okay. We're gonna draw for east. Three dot, that's a discard. And nobody can take it, so we're gonna draw four south. Nine bam, okay, let's see. Seven, eight, nine. Yeah, I think they're still in the same situation here. Either a seven or a red, no matter how you slice it. Actually, if we do this, they're ready on a five bam or a six, five bam or an eight bam. There are no eight bams out. There are three five bams out, but there's a chance for two tiles this way. Actually, yeah, two tiles. Two tiles, let's see. Pung. Oh, 
Okay, let's do that. So now they're ready on two tiles, seven BAM. And we'll draw up here for west, three BAM. That's a discard. Drawing four north, seven crack. Oh, so close. We are going to now draw four east, one dot. Drawing four south, two crack. We'll discard that. Let's Kong it. Two flower. Replacement. Five bam. We need to pair up. That's the last five bam. We'll discard that. Five bam. Mahjong. Mahjong. Five, six, seven. There's a chow. Seven, eight, nine. Chow. They have a Kong of green dragons, a Pung of five Bams, and they have two flowers that don't count. Oh, oh no, they do. They have a two flower right there. So we have three fawn for a half flush, a fawn for their dragon, so that's four, and a fawn for their flower, so that's five. Five fawn. Five fawn. This player was one away. They needed to pung and then get a pair. This player was probably two away. They needed to pung, pung. There were three away. And then this player was ready to win. I hope you enjoyed that solitaire game, and I hope it gave you an idea of what it's like to play if you've never played before. Don't forget to look below the video for the lesson playlist, and if you already know how to play and have a set at home, give this exercise a try and let me know if it helps your confidence. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click the bell when you do, that way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or maybe pick up an insight to the game that'll give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next solitaire for Hong Kong Mahjong, may all your picks be keepers.